I haven't mentioned the player's hands or swing yet. If the player can achieve the proper form in squashing the bug, I feel the swing is an easy part. It's like putting a puzzle together and the player is attempting to place the final few pieces together. The grip is quite simple. Have the player hold the bat with both hands touching each other along the handle of the bat. Hey Stanton, today we're going to work on how we hold the bat, okay? And the way we hold the bat, and I'm a left-handed hitter, is I take my right hand, place the bat in the uh, palm of your hand right here, and you're going to place the other hand also likewise in the palm of your hand like this, okay? And then you're going to pick the bat up this way. And the way that you know that you're uh, properly holding the bat are that these knuckles are lined up here and here, okay? And the way you know that is that you raise your index fingers this way. And if they're pointing straight up, that means your hands are aligned properly. If, take for example, I decided to go ahead and hold the bat this way and that way, and then I grip it, and then I stick my index fingers out, they're doing this. So what I have to do is I have to align my knuckles properly where my fingers are gripping properly, okay? I will also not have the hand along the butt of the bat because it handcuffs a player. I typically will take maybe the dimension of a, an adult index finger and I will have the bottom hand placed near the butt of the bat this way, okay? Now for a right-handed hitter, you just have your hands opposite. I have my left arm holding the bat here, my right arm placed as such. I make sure that my knuckles are lined up and I pick my fingers up.